Oh, the irony. Oh my god, my sides are splitting from all the delicious irony. So human vermin Antifa are doing their regular thing. Burning cities to the ground and creating anarchy. Just a little bit of cosplaying as terrorists among friends. What's a few ruined businesses and lives matter? They're having fun. But then they went to Kenosha, Wisconsin. And unlike Portland and Seattle, it appears this city doesn't put soy in the water. Because these people have fought back against this tyranny and disgusting behaviour. And it's wonderful to see. Lest we forget, these are people who have had their whole lives turned upside down. Because the people in charge of their towns and state hate Trump so much, they willingly allow this chaos to ensue. Instead of control it. In the wrong assumption, it doesn't make them look bad. And it all started because a group of fine gentlemen were protecting a local business and shot a person trying to loot said business. Beverly Fair, right? Actions of consequences. And after said soy boy was shot, here's what the Antifa lunatics have to say. Let's listen to this clip together. Well, that's quite the about turn, isn't it? Didn't you want to defund the police? Didn't you want to abolish the police? You just can't make it up. You can't throw bricks at the police and explosives for months on end and as soon as you need them for something, then demand their services. And the night before this, they tried to burn down the police precinct. Did they think trying to burn down and loot a city is consequence free? This just sums up this group's level of patheticness. Time and time again, Antifa has shown up to be hilarious babies who think their actions should have no consequences. And why? I'll just post this picture of a study done in 2017, which still rings true to this day. And of course, then call the police starts trending on Twitter, which results in a lot of people laughing at the soy on display, and a lot of weirdos doing mental gymnastics saying, ah well, burning people's businesses down is just vandalism, guys, it's still so okay. The logic these people use is astounding. I wonder if this fat ass would be okay with me just going out to his house and burning it to the ground. What would he do? Take me to Burger King for a thank you. Anyway, that's it for today's video. Thanks for the likes and subscriptions. I really appreciate it. Till next time, boy.